everybody, the set, or I should say the stage, is set behind us. We are ready to celebrate here on Local On 2. Thanks for joining us today. You can see the energy is already here. Oh, yes, yes, yes. yes. It's here. a perfect way to kick off a Tuesday. That's right. We are bringing the energy and kicking things off with a Grammy and Dove Award Ooh. winner. Welcome. Yes. <laughs> Four-time Grammy, two-time wow. Dove Award wow. winner. It list goes on and on. We have royalty in the house. I stole those words from Laura from just a few, <laughs> few seconds ago. Byron Chamber. AKA Mr. Talkbox celebrating 20 years of music, and he's inviting us to party with him. Welcome in! Hey. I'm so happy to hey. have you here. Hello! Yeah. I love it! <laughs> okay, because quick note, this is the uh, the talk box yes. that you used in 24 karat magic Absolutely. that you won this the Grammy is, for. Oh my gosh, this is the actual keyboard, this is the actual unit that I use and Wow, who would have and known? And it's here. And it's here, it's right here, you guys. Oh, I know, I feel like it should light up gold yeah. right now. I, you know what? <laughs> yes. I had it in gold, but we, 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 we turned it down. Yeah, we, okay, so if you didn't know at home how a talk box works, right. we're gonna play a little clip to, to show you how it works. Yeah, come on. Come on. <laughs> I mean, that gets the energy going. Energy. Okay. How does this all work? And how did you start in music? Wow. It goes way back to a little one. Yes, this thing has been around since the 30s. And basically, it's a it's a keyboard. The sound comes from the keyboard. Okay. And it goes into this little unit that I have here mm -hmm. with the speaker and the amp in it. And once I strike a note, the sound comes from this tube. And when I put that tube in my mouth, I get to control the wave sound, mm. and I turn them into words, Ooh. like this. Yes, go for it. Larissa and Laura Loco. <laughs> there you go. Oh, wow. That's how it works. That was really oh my cool. gosh. <laughs> Interview with you, and you always say that you want to inspire people. Yes. So, 20 years, over 20 years doing this, do you feel like you've accomplished that? Man, yes, a little bit. I believe I, I, I tapped into it a little bit. Yes, <laughs> yes. yes. I, I, it's just been a, a wild journey of uh, just inspiring singers, musicians. That you know, God. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a Christian, so I believe that God gives us all gifts, mm. and He gave me this gift of music. When I first heard it with uh, Roger and Zap. That was the first thing I said, I want to use this and I want to use it for God. I want to inspire people. And here we are. We've been able to touch billions of lives with this instrument. <laughs> it's Isn't that so crazy? And your voice. Oh my God. And your voice. And, and my voice. That's no, right. Cool. Now I know uh, we talked a little bit about how you got started with this, but how did you get started in music altogether? Oh, great question. I, I, I started my, my parents. They were uh, ministers at the church. And so we started in the church. Aww. So like, you know, I would, we would go to church and if the drummer wasn't able to be there, I jumped on the drums. Mm -hmm. If the organ player wasn't there, I just jumped on the organ. And whatever I was needed to do, I, I just went for it. Wow. And that's when I discovered I had a gift of music because it, it just came natural. Mm -hmm. I wasn't trained. I just literally, when I heard it, I sat down and I figured it out. And boom, here I am, you know, 20 years wow. later, I'm still There's doing not it. many people who could go, oh, the organ player is out. I'm going to jump into that. <laughs> yes. Are you kidding me? Yes. That's pretty amazing. Yeah, yeah, it's like so. a jam sesh with yourself. Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Yeah. I've never heard that way. That's so good. Yep. Wow. Oh, wow. My own jam session. That's, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that's what it's been for me. So, oh, and amazing. I love it. Yeah. Now, yeah. you got a big party coming up, and I'll, and I'll let Laura talk to you all about that, but yes. I want to know about some of these big names you've worked oh. with as well. Huge names. Ooh. What? Give us just a few, and just what has it been like? Yes, absolutely. Let's start with Bruno Mars. Let's let's go with Toby Mac. Y'all know Toby Mac. The, he's one of the biggest Christian artists of all time, in my, my humble opinion. Um, you know, Nathan let's, East. Nathan East. <laughs> My boy him. Nathan East. That's <laughs> yes. right. Which, which I'm going to be doing that song that y'all just heard on my 20 year anniversary. So 
Y'all, y'all got to come cool. see that live. But yeah, uh, man, I've worked with so many people. I forget sometimes. Any that have made you even nervous to yeah. meet? <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. I mean, just meeting Bruno Mars. I mean, that was yeah. crazy. Mm -hmm. Like meeting him, Nathan East. To be honest with you, because when I heard about Nathan East, I was a, I was a, a teenager mm -hmm. when I heard. I heard him on Anita Baker's album, and he did some of the biggest like the biggest bass lines of all time. And when I heard him, I was like, who is that guy? And it was like, Nathan East, he's the best. And then boom, I, I followed him. Then I got called to work with him. Oh, that's, oh my oh. gosh. So, you know, it's, it's been it's been wild. And then I've been able to take this instrument in multiple genres. Mm -hmm. Most people don't, don't know that. Like I've done this in reggae music. I've done it in country music. I've done it in smooth jazz. Yeah. And we've had all number one hits gospel. from all those yeah. and gospel. Uh -huh. yeah. Oh my gosh, yes. Exactly. So, there you go. Speaking of Cece Wine is who you just saw. You said she sent you a video yes. just now. Oh what are gosh. the chances? She is my she is my pastor. Like I, I go to her that. church. Oh. I go to Nashville Life Church. She's amazing. She's amazing. We're gonna be at church Sunday for Easter Sunday. <laughs> oh. Y'all better come. I'm playing I'm playing Sunday, so y'all better come. Nashville Life. <laughs> Y'all be yeah, in the house. Told, told, I'm going to that. But Come what on, I'm yeah. also going to go to is the Woolworth Theater. Tell yes. us all about us. Oh, man. Y'all, I'm so excited about this. I just kind of looked up. We've been, we've been having so much fun. I looked up, and it's 20 years of this. So we're going to celebrate it on the 20th, uh, well, the 21st of April. Mm -hmm. It's my 20 year anniversary. We're going to do a live recording. We're going to have some special guests pop in. It's going to be an amazing event. You do not want to miss it. Woolworth starts at 5. Oh, yeah, doors, doors open at 5. At five. Yep. Show starts at 6. At All six. ages, too. All ages. Bring your family, bring your kids. Anytime you come to a talk box show, it's family friendly. Yeah. You're going to be able to you're going to be able to just come and have an amazing time. We're going to party and I'm 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 just excited. Yes. <laughs> As y'all can see. Yes. And really quick, you know, yeah. 20 years of doing this. I know that you kind of broke the ceiling. You stepped into, you know, a leap of faith. You yes. took a leap of faith. Absolutely. So for other people out there who, you know, want to try something new, something yes. different, what do you have to say? Oh my gosh, go for it. Do it afraid. Do it oh. afraid. Mm. Okay, you're gonna get you're gonna get scared. You're gonna you you we could talk ourselves off the cliff. Like we could we could play games in our mind. Listen, don't let that negative voice do that. If you have a gift, go for it. Do it afraid because that fear is not gonna leave until you do it. Mm. That's and what I, happened to I me. bet when you do something with with fear, yeah. you you almost kind of put more into it. You put it. more into it. That passion is stronger. It's a reason why God gave us that emotion, I believe. Mm -hmm. And so that's why, you know, I'm fearless now. Oh. I've been doing it for so long. It's like when something comes, like, we just dropped the Apple commercial, yes. by the way. Yes, talk about that. Literally Let's dropped see. yesterday. We did an Apple, like, I got a call to be on an Apple commercial, and it just blew my mind. So, yeah, that, that was me taking that step of faith. Yeah. If I wouldn't have taken that step of faith, we wouldn't be here right yeah. now. So. What, what's it like when you do get these calls, whether it be for an Apple commercial or for to play with Bruno Mars yeah. or whatever it is? I literally... I, the first thing I do, I look up and I say, thank you, God, you did it again because it was him that gave me this gift. And I just, I start crying. And I know, you're getting emotional. I, get emotional. I can tell. Yeah, so it's, 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 it's because, you know, you, you're going to have negative voices that comes around you. People were looking at me crazy 20 years ago. I was like, what are you going to do with that little thing? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? And it's like, fast forward. <laughs> Here we Here are. Here we are. Look what you've done. Yeah, baby. Yes. <laughs> we love you so much. I love you Thank yes. you so Thank much. You. Oh, my gosh. Thank you. Thank you. Oh Everyone, celebrate with Mr. Talkbox. Like we said, at the Woolworth Theater, April 21st, head to mrtalkbox.com. Yes. yes. So exciting. Ooh.